Or everyone is <laughs> just chiming. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's going to be a clip. Uh, 
Anyways, ahoy everyone and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian today, along with my rather burpy first mate. The face of Drakir at your service! Uh, that, that, that was not planned. Uh, that was not planned in the absolute slightest. <laughs> Sorry, I, I, I got prepared some fizzy drink to help with my stomach a little bit since I've been eating pizza today, and... I don't know, it's good pizza, but something about that place... Makes me extremely thirsty afterwards, and a bit wee in the belly. How to say? Like I, I feel like I need something to lighten the belly or something. It uh, could be one of their ingredients or something. But anyways, again, uh, well, <clears throat> welcome back to Raymond Origins. Uh, yeah, I, I decided to just move to this screen a bit early because yeah, we've seen that this game auto saves yeah pl enough times already, and uh, yeah. Uh, let's continue where we left off. Uh, hello, Sentai Tadpole. <laughs> uh, uh, let's see. It's been a it's been a bit since we've been able to stream because uh, yeah, I've been getting late shifts again, which mean well, which cover both my the early and the late get, uh, moments that we can stream, unless we start like streaming at well midnight or something. But uh, yeah, let's see. Last time. We got uh, we freed the third of the kings, and yeah, we have only this extra level uh, left here. <laughs> that's mm. bearded dragon. Yeah, that that's a bit misspelled, but I will allow head pats. There's no booping in my snoot. I will bite. Hmm. So uh, yeah, we have this level left, uh, the king that's at the end of that, then there's probably the land of the livid dead still, and that summit, whatever is hidden behind there. Uh, so yeah, I think we can get another two streams out of this, we'll call this one and the next. And uh, yeah, how are you doing, Sentai? <clears throat> and back into the frying pan. Yep, oh dear. Uh, what the? Okay, back to the mosquito. I I completely missed the laser sight there of the muddy <laughs> knife. Uh, this world is just so absurd as it has me smiling just because of how dumb it is. And that's good to hear, Sentai. It's good to hear, and I also agree with you here. This world is insane in so many good ways. Yep, there goes. I keep forgetting that they can aim that. Oh, okay, the second one almost got me there. I didn't notice that it was above. Uh, and they were massive! Yeah, they, those weren't just normal little knives. We keep losing hey. extra lives here. Yeah, the, what the heck were those? I have no clue. This little devil imp, so almost got hit again there. These, I guess, are sort of drags, but they're like... The the bigger knife things? They look like tiny knives with massive handles? I, I, I have... Oh, hello. Uh, I have no idea what the proper wording is for different kinds of cutlery. I, I'm just a... Uh, yeah, I'm just a... What is the even... I, I'm too unsophisticated to even know the words for how unsophisticated I am. Here. <laughs> and yet you do use a lot of... Worse people will consider sophisticated. <laughs> so if it's weird for you to take call yourself that. Okay, we disturb that guy's flow fun. Run right through. These guys are just enjoying the the bouncy lemons or limes. And I mean those are limes. I have to say, if not for their eyes, they would look tasty. Um... I think we found the <laughs> the nightmare king. 
think we found the uh, king of this domain. Yeah. The gourmet king. And we're stuck. <laughs> okay. <laughs> At least we had a checkpoint. I didn't I didn't remember this game bringing in Nacrophilia and Boar. Can you repeat the first word? Macrophilia. Oh, macro. Okay, okay. Yep. I saw you say the macro. What way? Did you say me say necro? No. What way? How the heck that does it make sense? And uh, you said, right, right, I better ask double check. I think I have misheard something here. Okay, I thought that was going to land on our heads there. Is Nope, that's not it. Okay, that was a trap. That... <laughs> At least that's over. Chew! Not a banana fly. <laughs> Pardon. Well, that was a trip. <laughs> Still not yeah. one extra. And I just realized that last few steams you had issues with the fly, correct? Yep. Apparently it's my turn. At least mine's smaller. Uh, it seems our. No, not that. There. For some reason, the chatty program got uh, minimized. Okay. We are still. Four, no, 31 lums, not lums, electunes off from uh, getting, being able to access all of the teeth runs. Pickle fruit. Uh, yeah, 31, that should be doable in this world and whatever is between this and uh, the land of the living dead. Hopefully, but the videos will be used on the third stream of this game. Yeah, and it, it feels or, like we're on the fifth or so with how much progress we've been making. Yeah, but then I realized we did almost get stuck on the some of the Skull Teeth missions. Yeah, especially the, the ice area one here. Up to... Yeah. Three. So... Uh, so when we f he wondering if we, if we were able to finish it today or not, I was I was kinda in the middle for. I feel, so to feel like this one of the games where you do quick early progress until you fi get yourself into the final stages where it grinds to a halt. A bit too much <laughs> momentum there. Okay. Yeah, we can't just use these guys as platforms. I don't think we've ever done that. We've done that before now, but yeah. Let's see. Oh. There we go. I was about to move away. Canned sunfish. Canned angler. I'm actually curious if people eat those, actually. Swordfish, probably, because they are, well, fish for and all. Uh, oh, wait, we have to, we have to de defeat those of these, of course. Yeah, yes. Anglerfish just doesn't feel like something you usually eat. Like, I, I don't think I've seen them on fish markets, just... Don't really what kind of dish you do with them. I think they're much too bony to be a good dish and to make to be part of a good dish anyways. Uh well something at the source of species that you do cook as far as I know. Absolutely looks terrifying. Yeah. Like the flat ones that are on the bottom of the sea that use looks like they eats a more driving through the sand. Okay, for I, I, don't know I what... thought he wasn't popped. 
I think they're related to anglerfish, but not really sure. I forgot what we... I don't know what they call in English, but in Sweden we call them Morunk. This may sound like a monster name. This is just fitting, but they do look like monsters. Okay, no idea what happened to that specific one. So let's just move on. Hmm. Uh, but, but yeah, they, they're... There have been some pretty odd dishes throughout the world, though I, yeah, I really don't think anyone would eat angler fish, or at least willingly. Yeah, well, the thing I think about is, it's not like a, it's like the angler fish, but more commonly found near near Scandinavia. Territory is not as deep as the rest of the ocean, but apparently they're one of the few fish that have legs. <laughs> That's a new one. Oh, sort of. We all have something that sort of work as legs, if I'm right, to help them move at the bottom of the sand. But they don't swim around like a angler video is They're just almost flat on the sand and hiding in the sand. Only to then show the bloody face that looks like a monstrous face of a deep one. They. Uh, I don't know if they look more terrifying than an anglerfish or not, but... Yeah, I think that people do eat those, but rarely, as it's rare you catch one to begin with. Yeah. Okay, busting through. Do you give a heart? Because we lost ours already again. Yeah, you missed a few of those. Uh, I don't know if people did eat more type of animal do trouble due to it being less picky. Like, I think they actually ate swans in medieval ages. Yeah, I, I think they were uh, thought to be a delicacy. Yeah, they were. It's basically, you don't eat, eat them commonly, they're more like the. For special events like a wedding and a, and a very special party, you can see a noble server swan, but not on a regular basis. Yep. There we go. Okay, let's see what I've seen. Good progress. <clears throat> uh, yeah. Uh, we'll be doing another stream today as well, later, in, in the evening. Uh, but probably not... Oh, probably not Rayman, since, uh, yeah, it'd be a bit odd to double up on it. So, it'll it'll probably be Shante. Unless we manage to finish this game in this stream, which I find a bit doubtful. Since I think that uh, the land of the Livid Dead is pretty tough. Yeah... Like, I'm not saying because it's impossible. I am skeptical that we finish this today. Yeah. Okay, this looks like there's something hidden here. Okay, also, here. When, Coin. when did the... Um, fawn lemons start walking about? Bouncing? Uh, the, the previous level, I think. Yeah. Fawn lemons actually sounds t like a very nasty fruit. Yeah, I, I think it's more blood lemons or something. Blood oranges. Uh, yeah. No. For some reason, in the just recent year, they were talking about renaming bl blood oranges in Sweden to red oranges. Is I just question why? Uh, probably because people don't want to assume that, uh, well, there's blood in the oranges or something. I wouldn't be surprised if, if there's rumors that, uh, yeah, blood orange trees are fed with human blood or something. Uh, yeah, no, from what I recall, it was, it was just uh, some few parents thought uh, it was too scared for kids or something. And I, d I don't think they did change it. So. 
course, uh, the usual stuff. And that was the yeah. first in a while that we didn't get one of the extra long uh, elect tunes. Why do I keep falling back to Lums? Oh, that's what they usually used. Yeah. And there we have... Do they have names? Uh, they do have names, I think. Uh, I think the first one is called Mathilda or something. But the others, I don't know. There's probably... In... Does this game even have Steam cards? Let me double check. Uh, let's see. Origins... Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Okay, it doesn't seem like there's Steam cards for this, but I do recall that each of them have a name. So where Probably to find the this, manual. I don't know. Yeah, there, there's the ma there's a there's a PDF manual here. So let's take a quick look there. Oh, that that opened it up in a browser. Uh, let's see. Click to view manual. Uh, it's only one page, and it doesn't really work when clicking it. Okay. Well, putting that aside then. Probably for the best. Yeah. My heart burns for you. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's see if we get that... stuck on this one. Nice attempt on making a palm. You just remove a space. Oop. To make it a pun. I don't know if that's clever or extremely lazy of a joke. Yeah, it works for me. I'm not surprised. Okay, you're choking missing a bit because... You... Okay, I was joking about the war part. And he eat? Oh, he did eat an entire town. Yeah. But why would you he eat a mariachi band? <laughs> mariachi. Oh, that's what it. All right, my bad. <laughs> oh, that's one of those thorns. That. Wait, why are the? Right, okay, what are they and why are they armed with blinders? Yeah, what plungers? I don't think we want to know either of those answers. Actually, you know what? I think you're right. We don't want to know the answer. Nope. And here's the flames. Okay. Well, I certainly can say I didn't expect this. Uh. I sort of expected it since they seem to take way more inspiration for from older cartoons, almost. And let's be honest. It happened a lot, a lot of the things we see here happens a lot in older cartoons. Yeah. Uh. Okay, squeeze through there, and yeah, here we go. Wait, he ate an... He ate an entire pot? I'd say he's eaten a bit more than that, but yeah. Okay, so this is going to be a bit of a... Yep platforming puzzle and that we have to <laughs> dodge the freaking fire yeah that normally you oh, crap. normally it's a fire first then smoke when it's done like a flamethrower but i guess the smoke is the flammable gas yep also that's his literal heart in the background there wait if his heart is but okay, that, that does make sense for the bit stomach is closer to the heart than many people think. No. I'm pretty sure it's not supposed to be next to the heart. Yeah. So the heartburn is quite literally in this case. Did I pop that or not? I think I did. Oop. 
Okay, I almost didn't see the second flame there. There we go. Giving this guy a really upset stomach. Impressed by the fire animation, how it works, and here all that, but he's about to pop like a freaking. Oh. Okay. Yeah, either he's gonna explode or just. No, things are. Ah. Come on, really? Wait, what? Oh, come on. That, that. No. No. That's... Yeah, that was a rough bit of a bullshit moment there. Okay, at least we know what to do. And what is going to happen. It's just going to be difficult to, well, keep above the acid on the bubbles and such. Okay, second round. Oh, no, not that. <laughs> Don't you start as well now. <laughs> Oops, second flame. Right. Uh, I pray that that dude is not me. Just getting some extra lungs. Okay. Now it's going to go low. Curl around I, I, for another run. I really dig the music. Yeah. Not your typical boss music, but it's it's still nice. Oh yeah. I think I only just noticed now that the, the pink I don't even know what to call them, the pink bubbles. Uh they have little fangs. Fangs? I I noticed the eyes, but I did not notice the fangs. And oh they damn damn thing sinks! Oh wonderful! Come on. For no more. Come on, don't have too many. Oh, yeah, they do there have fangs. Go. Oh, another one. Oh, yep. Oh, no, now it's a GTFO moment. <laughs> Okay, let's get out before this guy farts himself to death. <laughs> Never mind. Wait. Let's... Okay, I don't have to redo that. <laughs> okay, I see. We need to clear up the blockages. Okay, okay for more that's the only way I will <laughs> refer to that. Yeah, I was worried that you were too needed to uh, let the fire open it for you, but uh, luckily. Look... Pretty sure that's not supposed to be in there. Yep. Look at you running, Rayman. The fighter is really on our tail. Woo! We get stuck on there. I'm sure. What is it with these random drop-offs? Where do are we? We're, I think the game is trying to prep us on this bit by almost trying to force us to jump from wall to wall. In those early bits. Okay. There. And out. Uh, 
Yeah. <laughs> Over there now, Moto Ben 8. Uh, oh, what's it? Point 8, Moto Ben Italian. I think, yeah. <laughs> I believe it means something like very good. And there we go. All of the elect tunes. And the extra stamp. Or metal, or whatever this is. <laughs> Wait, does that mean you did it a time bonus? <coughs> okay. That is all four of them freed. This, oh, I know what that is. That's the, the tricky uh, treasure uh, race that's opened up next to the chicken. But let's first take a look here. Okay, this is now open. It's a so let's check. Wait, right, there's a new yeah. exclamation mark there next to the bird queen? Yeah, yeah that's the tricky treasure. We haven't gotten yet. Oh. Yeah, we might as well go for that now. So a lot of extra things that we haven't gotten here with the time trials and such. Tuned up treasure. Okay, it's going to be a bit of a ma the viewers go race, I'm guessing. Okay. Ooh, that that cost us, yeah. Okay, full speed ahead. Still save that. I jumped a little there. Cities. This music is really almost almost classic cartoon. Yeah. Not exactly what was meant there, but it's still going. Small jumps. <laughs> that is also works. This one's pretty easy so far. No real. For the moment, I thought it was ending there already. For a moment, I thought you, you were to die there. Holy. And there we go. Almost got faked out, but still. That one was pretty good. <laughs> Not as frustrating yeah. as the ice one. Yeah, and you were able, we were able to, at least you were able to learn it quickly. I, I'm just a commentator here. Yeah. And extra brain and ice. Three more to go before we can get to the land of the livid dead. And yeah, there, there's one hidden here, it, which means that the shrimp and the little chef have one as well still. But we need 15 more to unlock all three of these, I think. Oh dear. So we might have to go back and redo uh, one or two levels to get enough. You know, maybe a bit more, but we'll see. First off though, new area. Hello. Did they just try to use Muppet Swedish? Yep. Focus, 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 focus. Okay, are we supposed to do anything? There we go. Straight through a bloody mountain. Hello, been a bit. Wow. Okay. Magician's pretty freaked out. 
And he falls asleep. Yep. Okay, he wasn't lying. We did get struck by lightning. And you missed the mosquito. Really? How? Okay, yeah. Flying through a thunderstorm is not the brightest idea one can have. Yeah. And I think one of the storms you should never go out in is a winter thunder. It's extremely rare. I've only seen it twice. And that, that, that is when you have thunderstorm in the middle of a snowstorm. And yeah, it's extremely recommend to stay indoors and not be on roads, apparently, when you do the, uh, when those are around, since they can apparently flip cars. Or maybe not flip, more of, Yeah, ice on the road, thunderstorm, ice storm, all that, that, that doesn't sound a good idea to be on the road, does it? Yeah. And. You'll be mostly protected whilst uh, you, if you get struck whilst you're in a car, but it's still going to freaking kill the car, I think. Yeah, that's well. You don't want to slip and slide on the road in the middle of the winter. And it's even recommended to not even walk in those weathers. Yeah. So why do these flies have engineer goggles? Uh, crew of the ship in the background? Oh, damn it. It seems kind of uh, storm punk. Damn it. Okay, Wait. Did you just get a checkpoint. I just realized the, the bigger flies are. Metal. Yeah. Copper. Isn't that double teamed? A, isn't that a very bad idea to be armored in in the clouds? Yeah. Any metal generally in <laughs> during lightning. Yeah, it's a, some more electricity like conductive than, other, than others, but. Let's be honest, you use copper wire for electronics. This means it is very conductive. Oh, hell. Okay, are that a storm generator or something? Really? It might be generated regarding the entry from the storm, possibly. Oh, well, here we maybe have the answer. Or they're feeding and you off broke the storm. It. No idea how I hit the other one, but okay. There we go, some bounce shots. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to <laughs> pass that little firestorm. Holy. Nope. Damn it. Yeah, things are getting a bit tricky, huh? Yeah. Let's put in it lightly. Okay, let's get the heart. And this time, let's not try to get shot down. There we go, bound shots. So, can we... Okay, we can't pick you up. Go. Can we destroy these? Yes, we can, actually. Yep. Yeah. And I still get hit. Damn it. <laughs> I'm trying to rush places where I probably shouldn't. That's a little lums. 
Probably gonna need it. I really should be using this more to deal with lines like that. Speaking of, screw you. <laughs> Bit of a snipe there. <laughs> okay, I didn't get to fully crack that shot, but he went places. Holy. Go. Much better. But here we're going to be getting harassed by the missiles. Take that out. And uh, one of them is removing the lumps around. Go. Okay, he's friendly fire among the missiles down there. And land, quick. There we go. Okay, how did we do on that then? We will soon sure we see. Got one of them. 18. Yeah, short as always. Yeah, but still. Yeah, I think we could have been more if I did for a split second off with one of the king ones. Maybe, but... Uh, yeah, we're still getting plenty of electunes to unlock the other treasure maps. Treasure levels. We need 23 to go. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go and throw some food into the uh, machine. Some on light. Okay. On top of old Smokey. Hmm. Ah, one of these punch upgrades. feeling there's probably a... Actually, no. I, I, we, we probably would have heard it now if there was a cage of electrons nearby. Let's see then. Nope. Oh. Air draft level again. With section at least. Okay, we got launched. Let's take that. Okay, Help. no touching the clouds Help. either. Help! Help! I'm back. Welcome back. Last strike. Uh, making a chicken burger to Tila Bread. Okay. Probably the light meal I need <laughs> after a half family pizza. Yes, when I buy pizza, but you should buy a family pizza just to have it for two days. But I each time just feel like it's a mistake. Okay, we just threw that <laughs> into the grinders. Oh, crap, but yeah, I'm at this point I start to wonder if I should complete this stop easy piece of eating it less and less and less. Damn it. That was my fault. Uh, I can typically put away uh, an entire pizza over at least a medium sized uh, in one meal. It, it, it will definitely be a heavy meal. Though, yeah, I could, <laughs> I could try saving parts more frequently. Yeah, and as well, when you buy a family pizza, you get free soda and some yours or pizza salad on the on the side as well. And those I just give to my uh, my mother usually. Okay, these little bender bots are pretty tricky. 
Yeah, also, do, there's another reason, like... Before the pandemic, they had slowly r r raised the prices, but it was slightly. But during the pandemic, like... Here's a... Pre-pandemic. A family pizza from where I buy it was for, like, 120 Swedish KR. That's, like, 12 euro. Okay. Now it's... 220. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, you hear, they... They almost doubled it. Almost. That was one way to get through. So, I, I get they needed to due to... Yeah, pandemic hit many industries rather hard. Yeah, cost and such. But still, almost t over 20 euro for a p big pizza. I just look at the regular size then. Yeah, they are about a uh, hundred. Okay, we tried there. It's... Yeah, the soda bottles, well, not... not <clears throat> they are nice. It can... I did not. In I did not intend to go for this for the coin there at all. Uh, one of the pizzerias we use typically order at they apparently import their soda bottles and mass from somewhere, which is annoying because that uh, means that uh, typically there would be uh, what is the word the, when you can return like yes, the bottles and such. Yeah. I think uh, there has been a movement to fix that. Like, they're either not allowed to do that, or try to make sure every bottle in the EU can be recycled. Like, no matter yeah. country, each other bottle should be able to be recycled. Or it should not be allowed. And I think that they have been doing that here, like, they're all allowed to buy in sodas for somewhere that has the recycling throughout the EU. Or was they not allowed to do it, I think. Mm, yes. But, yeah, you, you basically got to the point where I was going at... Uh, wherever they uh, import their soda bottles and such from... Uh, if I did not point down there. Uh, yeah, we, we can't trade them in uh, at the uh, yeah, usual stuff, so we have to put them in with the plastics to be recycled instead. Yeah, this was a problem. I hope that is getting more and more fixed. I can hear something. Also, really, we're balloon. We're making balloons out of these metal things, metal fish. I forgot we did that to stone as well. Yeah. Yeah. Do we? Here we do get wool one and a half liter. If you if you buy your family pizza during lunchtime. Yeah. yeah I, I think that's one of the reasons why they those can't be traded because most of the soda bottles over here are either one or two liters. So the one and a half liter bottles aren't really recognized by the machines for the well handing in of it. Wait, what? We have a reverse, like, we used to have two leaders bottles. And I used to have a lot of them. But one day, when I would finally to do, recycle them due to uh, dorm school, which meant I have a closet of the bottles need to recycling, I got it for a while. Then when I would finally to recycle them, they were no longer recyclable. Yeah. So I had, I, I probably lost about... Damn, damn it. Maybe a hundred, uh, ten euro worth or more for missing it by in three weeks. Okay, we almost had it there if it weren't for the lucky bastard that landed on the platform. Yeah, no, luckily enough, my mother paid me the money I should have had for those bottles, where she felt like. 
And I, it, it, it just felt like that was a bit of a bullshit move who made a rule for... Apparently there's many that, who missed out on it. Who were extremely short notice and not enough people had uh, been uh, gotten the info about it. Yeah. If you're going to put in changes like that, put in the damn work to tell people as well. Yeah, like... Like, they do know how all the ad advertisers about the recycling and all that. But they didn't... They only started to do that after the damn thing. Uh, uh, like, tunes get. There should be another gate somewhere. Really? <laughs> Don't think we'd need more of those punch upgrades. Okay. And the one, and the two, and the three. And there we go. Hard back. Can we make that? <laughs> the, the clang noise. There we go. Let's what the heck? You... What the heck? Here. Are they down here? Yes, they are. But yeah, the, these <laughs> these enemies we can't actually oh fuck we can't actually beat unless we just throw them into hazards. That was easy. Yeah, it, it looked it was to be to be very intense, but uh, did, did we get fake out? Maybe. But I very much doubt that the rest are going to be that easy. You mean like you get a hot instantly after that? Okay, I see how we're supposed to get that. We need to jump in between the boss saws. And then you were saying? jump from there. there. Did I catch up to the saws there or something? Yeah, we, what we need to do is to... Well... Is to... Yeah. No. Ilya, here's an advice. Aim for the wall, not the sauce. Yeah. There we go. Okay. I was about to get struck there, I'm pretty sure. We hadn't moved on. Okay. Okay, somewhere in between that we got took a hit. Yep, and there's a new one already. Thank you. Who designed this place? There's someone who didn't want visitors, I'm guessing. You. Uh, I'm gonna get away myself a drink. There we go. I was to say don't die, but well, maybe you just finished the level. <laughs> yeah, it really looks like 300 alumnus is the new is the standard for getting both the lag tunes at the end. I don't always stretch. 19 more. Mecha, no mistake. Going to take this moment to take a quick bite 
for my chocolate letter. Yeah. about those laser attacks is that they basically if, if, if you get stuck against something it's an instant kill well even if you don't get stuck against something it's, it's multi-hit it's a bit bullshit nothing hidden up there oh yeah uh van skis mm? no yo <laughs> I see it's still down there. Jovan Ski uh, uh, SN. I have no idea how he's supposed to pronounce that. Thank you for the follow all the same. I hope you'll enjoy the show. Okay, I can hear... I can hear the elect tunes and... That, yeah. And where are they hidden? Now, I... Hmm. Okay, it must be hidden up there somewhere. But yeah, definitely. And I don't think we're getting back up that way. Um, yeah, we'll have to get those some other time, if we need them. For now... <laughs> That's one way to definitely put an end to Rayman. <laughs> Crush him and cut him. Here, maybe a bit late. Hmm. This is going to take some timing. Uh, there we go. Perfectly. Uh, we're missing those lungs now. Uh, Jovanski, how are you doing today, actually? If I may ask. Uh, sometimes I feel like the game designers just wanted to torture their enemies with these, <laughs> these side bits. Okay, what the hell was that noise? <laughs> Missed me. Almost back, and welcome to one skin something, and hey, my Tudo, don't die! That's a bit hard when Rayman gets crushed against a bunch of saw blades. You think they're crushed by saw blades, you'll get sawed, no. sliced. Yeah, cr yeah, crushed against. There was a crusher and... <clears throat> And the uh, saw blades. Is it a meat grinder? Yep. It's... It's time. There we go. Okay, I was expecting the electrons there. Oh, they're down there. Okay, easy enough. I'm playing bloody side, really. Let's. Hey, come on, don't get cut up yourself. This this place is going to look like a bloody Meat Boy you know, level. Uh. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I have to say the Electoons are cute and all, but I much prefer... Uh, I much prefer not getting torn in two by a buzzsaw. Uh, cut in two. But I, I'd much, i much prefer the teen seas as the little safe. Yeah. And we're not getting those. Oop. Come on, there we go. And last but not least, 
the other side. Yep. Wait, more than one? Okay, Uno. Just barely got that. Okay, you know what? I think I'll just move on. It is one boss, so it's proving to be a bigger hazard than some of the bosses. Yep. And of course they double up. What the heck? I hope these are in times. And that they're proximity based. Go. Okay. That. These. Okay. Uh, that's a mistake. Oh, hello. Bye bye. What the heck? Okay, and then we just get out on this side. There we go. That was a pretty easy skull coin, actually. There we go. Oh, there's another light bulb of lums on that one. Down they go. Yeah, let, let's move on. Let's not get too stuck in one area at, for one <clears throat> at a time. Let's definitely not get killed <laughs> at the end of it. Oh, gimme that, gimme that, gimme that. Does that even work? No, that does not work. Oh well. <laughs> Those were two wasted shots, Ben. Wait, what is that? <laughs> Okay, that was just a stupid fail. And now you lost the thing. Like that. And it looks like these platforms are a bit timed because I think they're moving away at the end. Ow. Okay. Ow. And leave myself without enough altitude to actually continue. Okay. Oh, well no, done. Exactly. Really? Am I just going to get hit on that every time? If, if you attack in the air in this game, it really does stop your momentum dead in its tracks. Does it this time? Then I overshoot. <laughs> okay. Okay, smaller jump. There we go. Let's not get crushed. Instead, we got cut up. Okay. This this bit is challenging, but not a frustrating challenging. Uh, like the level is saying, stay the hell down there. It's picking us after we've already been sure <laughs> to fail. Okay, one, two, three. There we go. And done. There we go. That, that was pretty fun. Sure. Oh, uh, the damn thing starts turning. Okay. Uh, Wait, it's still that. alive? Not anymore. Now it's dead. I'm not sure if alive counts when dealing with robots. <laughs> 
Let, 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 let's not enter that topic. Okay, uh, maybe not robots, kind of... but... Yeah, there becomes a different debate when you enter cyborg and androids. Okay, let's not get caught up ourselves. And there we go. Okay, 254, that will ensure us another Electune. <laughs> yeah, and we could have gotten more, but bloody heck, getting more of those were quite a gamble in that room. Yeah. <clears throat> hmm. Let's see how many we have at the moment. 165 is going to be. Yep, another new one. Which means we May have 15 more to... That reminds, we have 35 to go. Oh dear, and make a new mistake. Yeah. The reveal. Did it do two mecha yokes and... Wait, what? The reveal? Now I am... Now I'm concerned. There was a back. Yeah, this little bastard is behind everything, actually. Oh. I guess there's the mecha. Crushed. Almost crushed. Uh, that might be ahead actually of looks scary compared to other bosses. Yeah, this, this is basically a mechanized version of the. Damn it. Of the plant boss with the same mechanics. How to feel about that? Gee, snap! Damn it! <laughs> and we don't have an extra heart. Okay. Okay. Should have seen that one coming. I hope we're not going to be fighting mechanized versions of each of the bosses. Okay, this time wait. Here we go. Okay, we know how he's going to start off. And I really, really hope we don't have to do a full rebeat count of all of them. Yeah, Why did they put in a checkpoint when we get to the arena? Yeah, but I would also like if they gave us proper health like in the other Rayman games. Yeah, but that wouldn't make the platforming as challenging. Nope, its neck got detached there from its body. There are many platforms that have multiple healths, more than one. And the charge. And yeah, the, the little bulbs have little fangs. Okay. What now? He's barely avoided the hit. Okay, this part is actually seeking us out. Okay, that was... Oh. Okay, so it is... Really? 
Yep, there's a what? Yep. There we go. Cutting that one off short. Okay, I think Sly Cooper wants to sue. What the heck? See, now it's going to... Nope. Okay, that works instead. Okay. So they are reprisals, but they're just two hits each. That that makes things a lot more bearable. Yeah, to, at the same time, you would fear them to make them harder versions. So there was better, well, supposed to be improvements. And I wouldn't say improvements, at the very least, copies. Okay, a little twerp. He fucks right off after him distracting them with the de with the end of level music. Yeah, I was wondering what the heck. Uh, uh, I actually thought the granny was to be the final boss. Uh, I think she might still be, but uh, yeah, this probably doesn't make much sense to uh, people less familiar with uh, Rayman. But the yeah, the Mister D here, uh, that is a. Um, no, th this is all allocate. No, and not allocating. Uh, alluring to uh, uh, Mr. Dark, who was the original Rayman. Uh, was the villain in the original Rayman? Hey. Okay, get back here, you. And also, for for a moment, I actually thought they snuck in a swear word. Where was the dancing and singing? Oh? I thought he said, fuck you! <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure he was probably thinking it at the very least. No, I just heard something about... Did he just say... Did he just say that? I hope I misheard. Kind of situation. But yeah, th this guy is a fanboy of the villain... <laughs> of the first villain of the Rayman series. I, I don't think Mr. Dark has ever been seen or directly involved in any of the games uh, since the first one. But I, I certainly wouldn't mind seeing him make a return in one of the games in the future. Hmm. Okay, where was the fault there? Go. Bit of a flip. Okay, at the very. I was about to say, at the very least, this isn't as bad as some of the treasure levels. But yeah, this guy's just a fanboy of the original villain. <laughs> That, that saw is, is probably going to be the one the thing that tells us if we're late or not in the chase. There we go. Okay, on beat. Okay.
go. Nope. Oh, come on. Uh oh. Uh, one of those levels. I do hope we get a checkpoint after that last part. There we go. One time. Go. Yeah, if Rayman 4 ever really does get made, I I certainly wouldn't mind if Mr. Dark was the villain in that game. Oh, oh I see what happens. Come on, there we go. Cheat that motherfucker. Yeah, no. Hmm. We both know they help me very how to say. Cont we don't know there is a continuity between any of the games. Yeah. But well, and this one like is I called. Said, uh, this guy is a uh, this guy is a fan from Mr. Dark, so we no damn it. That there, Mr. Dark is at the very least still in the past of this game. So there 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 is no solid. Uh, continuity, but there are still parts of the older games that are used. There's bloody black lumps in this game, for example. Yeah, though at the same time, this got Rayman Origins. Yeah, I it think that went, it's more meant that the game has gone back to the well origins of the franchise, being a 2D platformer and that. Oh yeah, that would make sense for. Normally, when you call a game Origins, you would expect it to be so sort of like they, a prequel or something. That missed. And when yeah, looking at the trailers, the trailer also gave the impression that this would be the, a prequel. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure what's going wrong at the ball jumping part at the end there. I'm pretty sure Raymond is supposed to still. Well, continue roll, uh, roll, yeah. roll running at that part, but no, he just goes to normal roll jumping. Hmm. Well, I only have one advice for you in this case. Uh, words for my wise work. Get good. Okay, roll run, roll run. Yes, I know that's not from an orc, but it sounds very orcish almost with the word git part. Come on. I know it's from Donkey Kong meme or some sort. Yeah. So, yeah, let's... It's time to get it on, though, like Donkey Kong. I... I never understood his name, like... I, I was also they couldn't... They, they didn't want him to sound too much like King Kong, but... Ready, donkey. Yes, it rhymes with monkey, but donkey is an entirely different animal. Yeah, I, I, I think it's supposed to translate to dumb ape or something. And yeah, I see what's going on. We, the, there's too much space um, to keep the wall run going. So yeah, I do need to start jumping against the wall. So. Damn it. Yeah, need I really need extra health. End. Okay. We better beat a bunch of electrons out of his pants for this. Okay. This part is pretty easy. Let's get up here. Start the wall run. Continue on. One, two, three. Okay. I think I went a bit early there. Seriously. Also, yeah, still the... just the aesthetics of this place, huh? Oh yeah, it is damn beautiful. Very. But it's not steampunk. But it's more like stormpunk. Yeah, brass punk, I think, is the words. Uh... 
still get that. Um, I think it is a storm punk due to they use el storms to power the cities. Has the own storm punk. The otherwise steampunk would be copper punk because they use a lot of copper. There we go. Okay, keep chasing. I think we might have got it now. You were saying? Uh. Don't worry, I'll be prepared a med kit for your pride later. Yeah, I had a feeling we were late on that. I'm not sure we can Extra really bandages. try jumping over that one. Yeah, I really hope that there isn't too much after that part where we keep where we get stuck on now. Because my hearts are starting a bit getting starting to get a bit clammy, or whatever the word would be, from uh, yeah, just holding this controller tightly. Your hand. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I thought you said heart. So I got a bit worried. Okay, wall, wall, kick. Okay. Fly, uh, fly Ray Man is cool. No, I was not intending to make a Lord of the Rings joke there. Ugh. What the heck? At least the music is rather subdued and not over the top for this part, because then it definitely would have gotten annoying. Yeah, yeah, you mean like uh, the the thief ones? Yeah. Yeah, but that, 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 it sounds fine at the beginning, but after a while it sounds mocking. Damn it. Well, so then ask me why this place is starting to come apart now. Maybe from our fights with the mecha bosses. Luckily, it was only two of them. Screw you and your boss song. Go. One, two, three, four. Wall, wall, kick. Okay, Rayman, just bloody fly this time. There we go. Thank you. Let's not get cut apart by that one. And grab on. There we go. This has got to be at the end of it. And it looks like it is. Oh. oh no. Oh. Yeah, he's been... He's been working with the hunters. You do realize we're right next to this re, huh? Nice. And now we're in hot pursuit. I thought for a moment he was to ride a mechanized uh, Murray eel. You gotta be careful because of those fireballs that come out of those. Really a giant ice machine? A giant blizzard machine? That's probably more... Yeah, the a giant blizzard machine. What the heck? Too late for that. Then too late to dodge that either. Okay. That, that. Okay, they take two shots to go off. And... Gotta be real careful of where we are and where the attacks are. It sounds like I'm just continually jinxing myself now, huh? Yeah, a little bit. So yeah, maybe I should just shut up. Uh... It's, uh, I would at this point consider it uh, both for your character and comedy. Okay. 
Less focus on actually on kills, more focus on avoidance. Wait, we set that yeah. off without taking damage? Not clear. It's something I might not give like sometimes there's a point where you need to evade and some point where it's better to fight. Yeah. Okay, grab that. Bowl that. Was that an actual boiling noise? Mm -hmm. Bowling noise. Yes, that they actually play a little <laughs> pin strike noise when you throw something. I, I am not surprised considering the cartoony style that I adopted for this one. At least the humor is not annoying like, you know, Rayman 3. Yeah. Taking that. Don't. Those extra lungs. Oh, so we can inhale those things? Okay. Oh, there we go. Play. I know I'm sure who will want a bomb stuffed off the stuffed stuffed up in the nose. I didn't expect to actually get through that without getting hit. Oops. I shouldn't have risked that. Okay, at least we have a checkpoint. that one but still we should be we should be sure of at least one elect two now which means we'll still have a plenty more to get before we can get all of the uh, teeth okay tone shifts uh, missiles So we can break parts of it off. Oh, damn it. The one little bastard that I missed. Okay. Oh dear. Luckily, another checkpoint. Surely we're, looks like we'll be tearing that thing apart. Really again. Okay, avoiding. Okay, there we go. That's a bunch more. This is getting tricky again. Yeah. Uh, this is why we were skeptical of being able to finish it in this stream. And this, at the third point, I, I'm not sure if next stream be even the, the last at the moment. Yeah, 
sneak, take the rudder off. Almost get hit by a freaking fly. Let's not get hit by flies this time. There we go. Not fireballs either. Okay. Take out the hatch. Suck. Yes, we can. Damn it. Uh. Oh, his face. Oh, we took out. Oh. Let's deal with you. Okay, where the hell are we now? Um. Oh. I'm guessing that's the power source. Or was. Wait, what? Uh, let's see how we did. Okay, then, yeah. <laughs> Very obvious that someone is missing now, probably because they got vaporized. So we actually didn't even need to, do, to harm the ship, I'm guessing. They would have crashed anyways. And yeah, that's the end of the main story. Uh, but we still have the land of the living dead. What the heck? Okay, I thought you could actually be destroying the, the credits here, but not in this game, it seems. So, uh... Can we skip this? Apparently not. Uh, yeah, we're not done with the game just yet. There is still the Land of the Livid Dead, which should still have a few of its own levels to deal with. A lot tougher levels, if I recall correctly. Uh, which we can... Well, we'll probably be breaking our heads over in a, when we get to them. Okay, so really no skip. No, but there, there is a special ender to finish that level, correct? Uh, I don't actually remember or not. It might just technically be challenge levels, but... Hmm. It might be good to investigate that. No, like if it, for that now. yeah, for if it is part of a uh, true ending, that it could be good, worth to do it. But if it's just a challenge level, yeah, then uh, what's the point? Let's see. Ta -ta. Raymond Orange in his land of living dead. Yeah, ta -ta -ta. Live it dead. Hmm. <clears throat> Um, okay, so at the be beginning of the game, Rayman, Glowbox, the Grand Minimus, the Goth Teen C, and the Bubble Dreamer. Okay, so it's not Polocus, the, the Bubble Dreamer. Uh, hmm. Let's see. The Land of the Livid Dead acts as an optional final level in the game. Its entrance in... 
in the snoring tree is guarded by one of the livid dead. The skeleton known as Mr. Death. Uh, when Mr. Death receives them, he steps aside and allows the heroes to pass. Once there, the hero en encounters many grannies. <laughs> they act as simple enemies. Uh, yeah, like the undead granny at the very start of the game. <laughs> Who's sick oh, everything dear. on them. Hmm. Yeah, there, there is more, a uh, bit more though, because there is, uh, there is one final boss there as well, I recall. Hmm. Um. Yeah, I, I kind of want to say we can still go for that, but we could maybe put it more as a side thing. Um. We'll just have to see how we might configure that out. It, I'll, I'll, hmm. If we run short on... Uh, no, we are still short on uh, Electunes. I'll probably go work on that off-screen then. Then we can do the uh, the treasure runs on-screen. Or on-stream. And then, yeah, Land of the Livid Dead after that. Hmm. It would probably make like for a, a bit of a shorter stream. Yeah, though at the same time, we both know you should not underestimate the treasure runs. Yeah. So, hmm. we, st we still have room for about half an hour. Um, yeah. Uh, hmm. Uh, we we yeah. could try to do some of the treasure runs now, if we can. I think we have gotten all of the ones that we have access to at the moment. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see what's after the credits still. And then we'll probably call it a bit earlier. Then later today we'll do Shantae. And... Hmm. Tomorrow... Yeah, if I if I can get the needed Electunes by tomorrow, we'll continue this. If not... Um, maybe we push Minecraft forwards a bit, or we start on No One Let's Forever early. Hmm. I'm a creator of Minecraft or No One Let's Forever too. Uh, I, I guess we'll just have to see how things go. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, were, we, were we to do Dogsty tomorrow as well? Uh, no, tomorrow I only have space for one uh, stream uh, in the afternoon, and okay, it looks like we can just close it. Uh, I don't think this... Yeah, I think this game came out before, after credits, things became a thing again, or became popular. So, shall we just go back to the Glade of Dreams and see how things are? Yeah, let's do that for... I am skeptical about this game having a off-the-credits scene. Yeah, I, I very much don't remember one either. Okay, Moody Clouds. It's, but it, uh, it, it would make sense for a more story-driven game, but let's be honest. Of all Rayman games we've we played so far, this one has the minimal amount of story. Yeah. And oh, it seems like we do have access to one tricky treasure. So let's go do that. And then I'll just see where would be the easiest electunes to get. Ice fishing? Ice. Yeah, and he was to say something there. Yeah, they've just been repeating the same lines every time, like uh, oh. the electunes will show the way or such. <clears throat> Okay, let's hope we don't have to that the ice physics aren't too much of a decider again. So far, so good. And there better not be a bloody jinx. So far, so good still. There is no real hard 
time limit on us at the moment. Um, you have something else instead to, there to worry about. <laughs> First bloody try. <laughs> uh, oh. the hell that the previous <laughs> one was? <sighs> oh, yeah, first ice one you did was all... But what? Did they not always take a whole an hour or more? Uh, a long ass time at the very least. Okay, we still need 33 electoons. So let's go look around a bit. Uh, so we've got that one. Uh, we don't have access to that tricky treasure. And we've gotten this one. I am not be surprised if earlier levels have mainly we have we had missed out. But it would be easier now since we have more skills to use. Yeah, let's see. We have 6, Holy. 8, 11, 14 we could get here. Uh, let's see. Da, 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 one, two. Oh, the, the middle ones are the time trial ones, I think. So let's actually go see what... How do we start this time trial stuff? Or is it just standard? Hmm. Yeah, let, let's give this a try, see if it automatically activates or not. Oop. Okay, 130 for an Electune, or what? Um, and less, okay, we need to finish in 130 to get the Electune, or in less than one minute and two seconds to get the awards. Okay. What? Okay. Yeah. Okay, that'll probably reset us back the entire three. Yep, yeah, okay. There we go. Yeah, this I can see instantly can become a problem. Like, if we our lost the electrons needed for the final level, lo secret levels, oh, it. it needs to be done timed. It's going to so drive us insane. How? Okay, I must have picked up a heart somewhere. Okay. Yeah, at the very least, we don't need 100% of all the Electoons, because that, was, that is 140-ish. Yeah, for... If we really did need that, that would just be... Yeah, a bit of an overkill. Okay, get rid of that one. Right, the geysers. Damn it. That's... And there we go. Electum gets. Okay. Oh, you missed it by four seconds due to that little delay there. Yeah. But. Uh, that doesn't look like it, it'll give us another elect soon. That'll just give us a trophy for bragging rights. Okay, so these early ones at least aren't too bad. Hmm. Oh, I said like two cage mods it has. Yeah, we can we skip past those this time because well the timer. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I I think we can still get this done. We need 32, 30, uh, 28, 25, 22. Okay. Uh, yeah, this. I think it's. I think it's doable. Um, might not be able to get it done by tomorrow, though, especially since we'll be streaming again uh, later. Uh, but yeah, definitely not impossible, especially since, uh, escape. Yep. 
Yeah, especially since there would be 64 other electrons to get still. Yeah. Holy. Okay. But yeah, I'll I'll work on that off screen because uh, otherwise it would be like well pulling teeth, and we we're not interested interested in pulling teeth. We're interested in getting teeth to give to Mr. Death. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. <laughs> right. Then let's move over here, close the game on down, and go look for someone to raid. Uh, oh, apparently I had the browser open the entire time. I forgot to close it after posting, uh, posting on Twitter, which uh, yeah is looking to be like it's going to go burning down in. <laughs> now that Elon Musk has got has uh, has taken control of it, and he seems to be doing everything he can to just destroy it underneath him. Uh, but enough on that. Let's see. First of all, oh, change the screen share to the browser so Ricky can actually see. Let's see. Uh, Rithian is actually online. He's playing Mega Man X. Then we have Kanai. I still don't know how to actually pronounce that. They are streaming Remnant from the Ashes. I think they were doing that last time as well. Uh, Iggy Maid is playing Planescape Torment. Okay. Pretty dark game. Extra Credits is online, streaming Alina of the Arena. That actually rhymes. I can't say I've heard of that. Rogue Review, Alina of the Arena, full release. Okay, they're doing a live review, I'm guessing, then? Hmm. Then here we have a new name, I think. Seth Dreskar, who is streaming Halo Reach. Spoo's Twitch, who is streaming... Cards, the World War II card game. Can't say I've heard of that. Mischief of Mice is streaming Elden Ring. Rufert is streaming Jurassic World Evolution 2. That might be of interest to you. Uh, those two are a bit too big for us to raid. Oh, who even <laughs> who even plays is streaming Deep Rock Galactic. And last but not least, we have Old Man Mordaith, who is streaming Solaris. Uh, I'm guessing it's going to be a toss-up between Deep Rock and Jurassic World. Yeah, between those two. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's say let's mute the site first off, so we don't accidentally steal some of their audio, and take a little bit of a peek here. Okay. I'm guessing they're still early in or something, but oh, it's just from a glance that's not uh, too uh, <clears throat> that's not too easy to judge. Uh, yeah, let, let's give them a raid. Let's copy their name. It's a bit rare these days to find people who with simple names for their stream uh, for their stream names. Okay. Most of course, it's rather hard to do. Yeah, uh, that that's why I put the captain in front of mine because yeah, it adds a bit more of a descriptor of what the hell our theme is. Not that we have a theme with games to keep with, but the general aesthetic theme that is. Yeah, and also it's hard to make a short, simple name that's unique. Yeah, for other mm -hmm. short, simple names might be several of. All right then. Uh, before we start the raid, though, and what is this thing? Chat highlight settings? Okay, I don't know why that has a notification thing next to it, but oh well. Uh, yeah, before we start the raids, uh, oh, Dogle someone who just came on, Dogly Douglas McDog, they're still busy with Tomb Raider. Uh, the Tomb Raider is basically the only thing I've seen them do so far. Apparently, they run challenges in it, like no heals, no saves, trying to get through levels in one go. Uh, not my thing, but uh, yeah, if they enjoy it, all the power to them. <clears throat> yeah, as long as they enjoy it and are happy. Yeah. Uh, yeah. For now, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Thank you, uh, Sentai Tadpole, for showing up and chatting a bit. And thank you, uh, what was the name again? Uh, Yuvansky. Uh, Yuvansky SN, I'm going to presume that now she is supposed to be. Thank you for the follow. I uh, hope you'll enjoy more of what we'll do. If not, well, the unfollow button is there as well. And uh, as always, thank you as well, Drakir.
<laughs> You're welcome as always. Uh, starting and ending this stream with the burp, huh? <laughs> I can't help it. I blame the drink. Yeah, that you aren't airing beforehand, like you said you uh, usually do. I, and I, I actually tried to sp uh, add water to it to reduce it and a lot of ice, but apparently it did not work. Anyways, let's start the raids, and yeah, uh, like I've said twice before now, we will be streaming again today in about, let's see, da -da -da -da, five hours, uh, about two hours or something. Um, yeah, we'll be continuing with Shantae there. Uh, maybe finish off Pirate Queen's quest, maybe not, we'll see. <laughs> I certainly wouldn't mind a, a few more streams of that game, but it does have to end eventually. Yeah, but it's fun so far. Okay, so yeah. Again, thank you anyone has been watching now or later. And until next time, have a nice day. And until then. Be safe, everyone. And watch out for seagulls.